Welcome to the channel everybody and thank you so much for joining me today. We are playing some green hell and I am out here just in the middle of the jungle. We've been we've been traveling. I'm trying to locate one of the tribal villages so I can sneak up on it and get a look at their smoker. I want to figure out how to start preserving meat and you know anything else that I come across I'd like to learn about. So we're we're up here just kind of wandering. I've uh I've lost my bearings like as to where we were and where what direction we were headed i know it was like a northeasterly direction so it's kind of in this headed in this general vicinity of course we got the rocks in front of us so we're gonna try and go around here let's we'll see what's this what this leads to a huh, big dead end go figure so we're just moving we're just moving through the jungle slowly learning the lay of the land okay so here's a cave. Let's 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 go inside the cave. Uh oh, he needs to drink. That's right. We got hit by a cat. I forgot. Was it a cat? Yeah, I think we got attacked right at the end there by a cat. Something attacked us, and we've got a fever, so we're kind of waiting for that to go away. Let me look and see here. What time is it? Five thirty. We should start to think about a, a bed. Um, crazy thing is, I'm pretty sure there's a bed down there. Yeah, there it is right there. So that's where we'll sleep for tonight. Because, uh, this was one of our first original places to, uh, set up a little, uh, sleeping area. We'll just head down there. Not going to be making any fires, but I should drop my, uh, my shells. In my cooking pot. I think that's what I've got in my cooking pot. Oh, speaking of shells... I don't even know if I'm going to keep this meat. I just want the shell so we can uh, get some extra water tonight. Oh, there is a fire here. Alright, let's see. Do, do, do. Let's drop that. Drop that. Yeah, he's getting sleepy. So we got a little bit of tortoise meat. Let me look here. What are we looking at? Uh, we're pretty solid on our food. We could just uh, go to sleep whenever. Um... We'll have some water in the morning, so let's go ahead. Let's let's get the, rid of this stupid fever we've got going on. I don't know, somehow we got hit by the cat and that gave us a fever. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, it's two in the morning, so <clears throat> of course it's uh, raining out here. Let's scoop up some water. All right, that's not quite full, so. We want to get this full if possible. Let's see here. We need a little bit of carbs, a little bit of protein, a little bit of everything. So, eat up some of these. Wait, hold on. That's two hours. Yeah, I probably should eat these first. These have five hours to go. Oh no, this one has 49 minutes. Okay. <clears throat> Nine hours, ten hours, eight hours. We should be eating these too. Okay, not bad, not bad. Um, let me look at my notebook real quick. What's it telling me about here? Rash, venom. Okay. Whatever. <clears throat> so, I do want to kind of actually look through my book here and see... If it's possible that we discovered something else, I don't think so, but I just want to kind of start to keep track of what I've learned here because I'm getting to the point on this playthrough where I kind of want to start building now, you know. Uh, this mud filter looks pretty cool. I'll have to focus on making this. Oh yeah, the killer trap. Heck yeah, we're going to set one of those up for sure. Fish trap. Yeah, see, I feel like we need to set up a place that's near a nice body of water. For sure. Because one thing I've learned recently is there are dry seasons in this game. So sometimes we'll, uh, <coughs> we'll, we'll encounter stretches of days where it won't rain so much. And it might be a little bit harder to, uh, to 
get some stuff. I want to get water. I want to kill this guy if he turns around. Shoot him in his face. Also, recently I learned watching a, a tip video to hold down shift whenever you draw. And that will uh, steady your arrow a little bit. Come on, man. What are you doing? I don't want to shoot you in the butt. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Nice, nice. Um, so, I, I really just want the shell. <clears throat> I've, uh, I've actually forgotten what... What that requires for crafting. Hold on. I thought we made it, though, already. So, shouldn't I know it? Shouldn't I have it in my notebook? Hmm. What would it be under? Maybe it's not in my notebook. Oh, look, there's a torch. Stick and a rope. Huh. I wonder if those... Oh, there it is. Banana leaf... Rope times two and armadillo shell. So I need a banana leaf. And I think this is one right here. Yep. All right. And come on. Let me pick up the leaves, please. Oh, come on. Sometimes it does this. It gets a little buggy. Like, even though there's a bunch of banana leaves right here next to me, it won't let me pick them up. Alright, let me just grab that. I know it won't work. He'll drop it, but sometimes that helps. I can't pick it up. <clears throat> can't pick any of them up. What the hell? Come on. Oh, there we go. I got it now. <clears throat> Where the hell's the shell at? <laughs> I lost the shell now. One, two. Where? I swear it was just right here. I dropped it a second ago. Hmm. Crap, I'm like in the water now. There it is. I just saw it. <laughs> what? Why can't I? Oh, okay. Just being difficult. Just being difficult. Okay, cool. Now, probably have to drop it. Can I hold it? No. No. Oof, too many arrows. Alright, there we go. Now, let's go over to our body. And I'm going to put this on my leg here. We're going to need a second one, obviously, but for right now, that'll work. We've got three pieces of armor. Hey, get away from my water, stupid thing. Okay, what time is it? <clears throat> I've still got the down red arrow on my meter here. I don't know why exactly. We need protein. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on with that. Like, this little red... Right here. I'm going to drop that. Got some raw meat. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and eat the peccary meat. And... Doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm just going to eat all these up because I'm sure that I'll... Uh, I'll come across more. I'm certain of it. <clears throat> and they just end up going bad in my bag anyway, so. One hour. Let's eat it. Okay. That's good. Uh, we've gotten low, but that's not a big deal. I've got a little bit of raw meat on me still. So let me check my water. Get this filled. Okay. I don't know. Can we fit that? Yeah, we'll take it along. Alright, let's go. Now, <clears throat> trying to remember 
which way we went from this location to get to the swimming camp and stuff. Oh, I did say I was going to go in here, didn't I? Ooh, mushroom. Or I'm sorry, not a mushroom, it's a snail. Uh, we got to watch out, though. <gasps> Damn it, that's what I was watching, wanting to watch out for. Crap. Okay, so we got envenomated. Let me look at my body. Yeah, take that off, please. So we'll just have to put... That's what's doing it right there is my heal, or my wound. That's probably why my... I've got that red arrow, because I've got a wound that's not fully healed. Did we even get poisoned? We got a fever, but... I don't see... Like a... Like a mark. When you get hit by a snake, you get a mark. You had to put a bandage on it, but... That was just a mild fever. Whoa. Christ. Thank you. Oh, this is fun, carrying all these spiders and scorpions around in my bag. I just love that. Okay, we gotta watch it. Oh, the rain just suddenly stopped all of a sudden. Yeah, real quiet in here. Real quiet and ominous. It's good though, now I can hear the little critters. Ah, uh, this is just a mine. Shoot. <clears throat> well, I guess eventually this would be a solid place to set up a camp, you know. But um, as it stands, we don't have any need or I don't even the knowledge of how to access that. So let's just keep moving on. Hey, let me grab these bananas real quick. For some reason I want to say that Oh, don't have enough? Okay, hold on. I'll go ahead and eat. <clears throat> go ahead and eat a couple. Yeah, I want to say that we went this way originally after leaving this area. So let's go back this direction. I don't know. I'm just wandering around in the jungle. Probably the worst possible thing you could do. But I don't have any great way of uh, navigating. We did get the map, though. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What is it? F? No, oh, F's not. Okay, so does it show where we are? I haven't used this too much. A2, what's that? <clears throat> I'm not familiar with how this map works. I, sh I need to watch, uh, watch a video on it. But... Hmm. What is that right there? Oh, he's got that fever. Hold on. Hold your horses, buddy. We got plenty of water for you. There you go. <clears throat> yeah, he's going to get tired a little bit early today, too, so we might have to rest. Ah, uh, you know what? Maybe we should head back to the camp and just, just sleep off this fever before we actually leave. We'll, we'll lose a couple of hours of daylight, but at least we don't have to worry about wandering around with a stupid fever. There we go. Alright. <clears throat> Took longer than I had hoped, but we're fine. Well, let me look at my stats here, actually. Yeah, we're fine. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Let's take the high ground. Oh, we got some leeches on us. We have five of them. Jesus. Wow. We walked through the, the leech uh, heaven right there. Up oh, here's some mushrooms. Hmm. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just want to see here. We got plenty of dressing. <coughs> <coughs> now doo -doo -doo. we are looking for a village basically I want to I, I want to stumble across the tribals believe it or not I just don't know where that would be 
Normally when you don't want to see them, that's that's when you find them. Whoa, 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 whoa. I hear something. Where is that? Guys, we got something on us, I think. Where the hell is it? it sounds like one of those pumas. There he is. Okay, let me look at myself. Did it get me? Did it get me? That's an old one. I don't think he got us. I think we're fine. Okay, let's get my uh, my arrow. I was going to say, I know that sound. I've heard that. Damn pumas. Okay. It's almost like a... Not like a scary sound. It's just like a purring, you know. Almost like a purring sound. And... <clears throat> we got him. Shot him in his face. Come on, can I get the mushroom, please? Thank you. <clears throat> Let's eat these blue mushrooms. I'm pretty sure they give me energy, so we might need that after our food poisoning. Yeah. Oh, wow. Those are potent. Super potent. Alright, we're just going to hold off. Save us a couple of those. We got some Brazil nuts too. I'm not going to harvest them though because they go bad pretty quick. So, hey, hey, Puma. Oh, teabagging on you there, buddy. All right, let's move on. I think we were headed in this direction. <coughs> oh, my health is still going down though. I don't, I swear I didn't get hit by the Puma. I think it's just this injury in my leg that hasn't quite healed and I can't do anything to it I put the ash bandage on it and that's that's it I think hold on let me look can I put a regular bandage on it no see nothing works okay well I suppose it's healing it's just it's hard to tell it looks disgusting whoa better hurt her something else Alright, let's keep going up this way. I feel like if I was a tribal, this is where I'd set up my uh, my village here. And I have all kinds of smokers and stuff sitting out. Real easy for people to see. Okay. I do like sticking close to the to the rock wall here because I feel like we're obviously we're at the edge of the map here. Here's some piggy wiggies. Just watching out, just just staying aware of my situation, my surroundings. Trying to at least. All right, moving away from the wall a little bit. Let me look down over this edge here. See what we can see. Oh, fruit. What is that right there? We've got the bird. Hmm. I feel like I should know this area. Maybe we're closer to the village. Not the village. The, uh, the camp. Yeah, I see some jeep tracks here. Hmm. Shoot. Ah. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 I recognize that. I've slept there before. There's a there's a sleeping spot there. Yeah, I'll take it. Oh, whew, we are way, weighted down just by that one mushroom. Really did it to us. Oh, we just got food poisoning. Crap. Don't think we have anything to treat that. <coughs> Not a hundred percent sure. I don't think that's this will help us. No. <laughs> I don't want to eat the scorpions. I don't know why I'm carrying those around. To be honest, I know that one of the spiders you can make a bandage out of, but honestly, we're just gonna drop these. Now, am I carrying rancid meat here? Shit. Yeah, I let my turtle meat go bad. Okay, no biggie, no biggie. Shoot, my coconut went bad too. I'm so terrible. 
this is why you just you just need to eat you know don't don't like save stuff just eat it okay we'll drink a little bit <clears throat> Okay, buddy. <clears throat> You're going to get over it. Eventually. It's going to be a while. Mm. I think we can eat charcoal to help settle our stomachs, but I don't know about these. I don't know if that's just a waste if we do that. So we can move on. He might be a little slowed or something. I don't know, but should be okay. There's a log there. Did we do that? It's possible we did, because like I said, there is a uh, bed here that I, I set this up myself hmm let's follow this road this is interesting perhaps this is the tribal the way to the tribal village uh, I feel like it's possible okay we got the waterfall straight ahead Go take a look at that. Oh, that's not a waterfall. I'm, for some reason, I thought that was falling water. No, nope, I'm dumb. It's just a cave of sorts. Yeah, I've definitely come this way before. I just don't know. Uh. Just not sure. Not sure about where a village would be. So, right, though. The more we go through here, the more I've, I'm learning this area, you know? Learning this map. Okay. That kind of goes back up the way that we just were. No, though. Let's check it. Looks intriguing to me. <clears throat> Man, it's like when we want to find tribals, we just never do, but... Um, got some hickories around us, but nothing else special. Now, now we're kind of backtracking, but... Uh, <coughs> I'm just looking. Oh, I thought that was a coconut. No, nope, little baby armadillo. Hello there, baby. Okay. I'm not too worried about getting lost or anything like that. It's all uh, it's all the process of discovery anyway. You know what I was thinking? Once this character dies, because I'm sure he will eventually. It's not like this guy's going to live forever. But once this guy perishes, I think I'm going to start over with the Green Hell difficulty. I think I'm ready for it to, go, to try the ultimate difficulty. I at least want to try it. You know, see what it's all about. See if... Because you know what the description says. But of course, actually playing the difficulty, that's really what makes the... You know, makes or breaks a playthrough. Learning it, figuring out what's really difficult about it. So, that's going to be my thing. We're going to do some green hell difficulty. Some true green hell next. Alright, hold up here. Hold up. What's up here? Hmm. Oh, we got a nice little place to build a base right there. It's an interesting spot. You're not too far from the water, you know. <clears throat> and this looks like a... I don't know, I bet this water might dry up during the dry season. Because it's not very much water here, is there? It's pretty thin. Pretty thin stuff. Hmm. I'm almost to the point where I, uh, I kind of want to set up a fire for the night. What time is it? 
Yeah, let's let's harvest this guy because I think we might try and set up a fire. At least we'll set up a bed, at the very least. I don't know if there if there's like a natural overhang or something that'll protect a fire. That'd be cool as hell. I don't know if we'll find something like that though. Oh, here's a coconut. Nope. Oh. Okay, let's see here. Um, I should probably see what's what's a viable place for a bed. Usually, that's the best criteria to figure out where you're gonna set up the n set up for the night. Yeah. Okay, this is a good spot right here. Okay, there's another bed built. It's kind of a random location, just in the middle of the jungle, but that's okay. No big deal. Uh, not necessarily trying to find all these places again at some point in the future, but it's just good to have them around. Okay, so this is all bamboo. I don't know if we can start a fire with that. That's a small palm tree right there. It looks dead. Can we chop that down? I don't think so. <laughs> We're just uh, pointlessly swinging our axe at that thing. Alright. Interesting spot here. This is actually not that random of a spot, is it? Ooh, snail. Is this a cave right here? I think it is. So, we'll explore this tomorrow morning for sure. You know what? Wait a second. Can we build a fire under here? I don't know what this is, but there's like chests here and stuff. Oh, wow. Oh, there's a bed here! And coconuts set up! What the hell? Who's, whose spot is this? Obsidian stone? Whoa, what is this place? Painkillers? Whoa, alright. Guys, I think we just found our permanent base. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, but... This is awesome. How much would you give to spawn near this place? Like, it's at the very start of your run, you know? There's freaking coconuts here. There's bowls already set up for you. Jesus, this is the best. Yeah, and it's, I'm assuming it's a natural shelter here where I can just build a fire. In fact, let's do that because I'm really loaded down. And it suddenly just got really dark here. All right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just do it right there. I don't have much wood, so we're going to have to venture out in the darkness, but that's okay. Thank you. Also, I don't want... I've got too much weight right now. I think it's... I'll just drop these here for now. I don't think we're going to get water out of them. Yeah, maybe I should just drop them outside. It's probably smarter. That's the bed. Well, <laughs> we've got two beds at this location. One just outside and one in the awesome little cave. Oh, this is the best. Okay, we'll let those get filled up. Let's uh, Let's get some wood. We're going to be super heavy. I should probably drop some of this raw meat. So I'm not carrying around with so much weight. Okay, let's drop that right by the fire. Perfect. 
All right, so we're going to head out and get some wood. Hopefully it won't be too difficult. There's a lot of, like, stupid palm trees around here we can't cut down, but there's got to be one or two s narrow ones here. Like this one, beautiful. Is that... I can't tell if this is a palm tree or not. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. we're good here. Well, guys, thank you so much for joining me here for this episode of the uh, the Green Hell. I really appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. I'm having tons of fun with this game. I'm starting to catch on to it, too. So come back next episode, and we're going to have even more fun living in the cave now. We're cave dwellers here. This is our new home, so get used to it. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you next time, guys.